So what does tonight's accomplishment mean to you? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's obviously uh, an accomplishment. I think whenever you're playing for, for something, for a trophy, it's never, uh, I don't know, never something you take lightly. Um, I think it's kind of good for us to have that uh, that mentality of, of the, the extra sense of urgency going into the playoffs. And now it's a quick quick turn of the page and get ready uh, get ready for the real stuff. What do you think a finish like this can do for the team's psyche going to the playoffs? Um, I mean, I think it's been pretty pretty consistent all year. On uh, even if we drop a couple games, the bounce back and the mentality that we have. Um, I don't know. I think we've just kind of proven to ourselves over and over again the the kind of character I guess we have in the room and the resilience and when we want to play good hockey we're, we're capable of playing pretty good hockey. What can you say about Lobby Lett's emphasis on competes from the start of the season and how the rest of this team has bought into that? Yeah, I, mean, I think it started in, in training camp, before training camp. Um, it's been sustained in practice. I think we, we always compete. And there's there's fun. I think as, as athletes, it's fun to compete, especially with your buddies and your teammates um, in practice, and that, that carries over into the game, and you kind of have that energy. I mean, at the end of the day, I guess as athletes, like, you just want to compete and, and win something, and whenever you get the opportunity to, to win something, it's, it's special, and that's why we're all here. How much of a goal was the President's Trophy through the season? Um, I don't think it was really thought about much throughout the season. Maybe the last couple games when you know you have an opportunity, it's... Uh, like I said, you're, you're a competitor. If you have an opportunity to win something, you, you always want to win. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I think it's something uh, something to be proud of, honestly. I think uh, not everybody gets to do it. I've never done it in my career. Um, uh, maybe something you look back on later, but right now it's kind of turned the page pretty quick and, and look forward to the playoffs. Has that been a mentality that's kind of gotten you guys to this point? You know, it, Peter Laviolette talks about focusing on those two points, the next mm -hmm. two points, and then the accolades will come with that. Is that kind of the same thing as you look ahead now? Yeah, I think I mean, you want to keep keep building. We've put ourselves in, a, in the best position that we can. Um, but yeah, it's kind of it's over with, so <laughs> it's time to move on and focus on whoever we play in the first round and that first game and, and build from there. And I think uh, that's what we've done all year is focus one game at a time. And if things don't go our way, we've been pretty good at turning the page and, and refocusing and I guess re-channeling re our energy to, to the right places. And uh, yeah, I think uh, we feel like we got a good thing going in here. I think throughout the whole year there's been, I think, uh, you know, an 82 game season, you look at any team, there's going to be lulls. Uh, you know, we had a, a bit of a lull in January and still were able to finish first in the league. but. Uh, yeah, even back from that All-Star break, I think we won like eight straight or something coming out of it, and uh, you know tied the franchise record for for winning streak. And uh, but I think games like that, games two one against Colorado at home, I think those are uh, you know good tests for us and uh, challenges that we were able to step up for. What character traits just have emerged all season from this group that's kind of gotten you to this point? Yeah, a, a pretty resilient group, I think. There's been so many games of, of different ways, one nothing, two one, six five. Uh, you know, it's it's been a full team effort. When we needed goaltending, we got it, and we needed you know depth scoring, we got it. We needed our top guys to step up, and uh, you know it's kind of been everyone chipping in. And uh, you know it's not always been you know goals. It's been other things too, and uh, you know penalty kill, power play, and, and that stuff like that. So I think everyone's just done a good job. Of Finishing the season this way can do for the team's Yeah, uh, you know, you don't want to have bad habits going into that, that game one. And uh, like I said, it is game 82, but a game that, that we wanted. And, uh, you know, I thought we did a good job of, of bearing down. And, uh, you know, the crowd was into it, too. That always that always helps us. So, uh, yeah, I think we did a good job of, of uh, you know, finishing the season strong and hopefully carrying that into playoffs. How big was your shorthand goal? <laughs> Yeah, I, you know, I think whenever you have a one nothing lead, you always, you know, we had a lot of chances, and you want that second one because uh, all it takes is one bounce for them to, to tie it up, and then it's, you know, back and forth. So uh, I think any time we were able to get that, that second goal, it was, uh, you know, important. And you're ready for the playoffs. Yeah, it was awesome. Um, I think that's, uh, you know, the game we want to play, uh, shutting it down and, uh, you know, kind of creating offense. Mm -hmm. Peter mentioned just some consistency from your line. What, what are you noticing in these last couple of games? Yeah, we got way better. Um, you know, I think as, uh, as that regular end of the regular season went on, um, you know, I think we started off well and then had a little lull, and, um, you know, I think we're, uh, we're back at, uh, you know, uh, ramping it up at the right time. What's, what's the feeling for you scoring the first goal in such an important game? Yeah, it feels good. Um, you know, in any way I uh, can help contribute. Um, 
you know, I was joking with Wani, I said they can't, they couldn't do it without us, so, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's you know, just a special time to uh, be able to come in and, you know, be a helping hand. Is this team playoff ready at this moment? Yeah, yeah, I mean, uh, you know, I think that, uh, you know, we're, uh, we're pretty strong, uh, you know, in all, all uh, facets of the game, so we got to, uh, you know, just keep on playing and, uh, you know, remember to, uh, you know, these guys need to remember what they, you know, what they've done, uh, you know, all year. And um, like I said, we're uh, we're here to to help and uh, you know keep on pushing. You mentioned just coming in and being able to contribute. So, what does this President's Trophy mean to you as well to be part of this group? Yeah, yeah, it's amazing. Just to uh, you know, I I find myself talking a lot about uh, you know the first years I uh, I had when we went to the playoffs. So uh, you know, I think it's uh, just that uh, that excitement and uh, you know building memories. You. You got big nights from Fox, Panera, and all your big guys. Just how big was having them drag you into the fight? Yeah, I mean, we're going to need it. So, uh, you know, it's it's great to see those guys uh, do what they do. And, uh, you know, it's such a high level and such, uh, you know, important times. And, you know, they're uh, they're ready as well. Just how's it been for you jumping into a group that's this tight-knit, has a big camaraderie, I guess? Yeah, no, it's uh, it's it's been great. They, uh, you know, they're very, very open and welcoming. And like I said, you know, it's just... Uh, you know, keeping your, your ears open and, uh, you know, just trying to uh, fit, uh, fit your way in.